Hey YouTube, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Carrie, and today we're going to be doing acrylic nails for the first time. This is my first time doing acrylic nails, you know. And uh, I done press ons like in my last video. No, the one before Get Ready with Me for Fourth of July. In my last video, the one before that one. Um, that was my first time trying the press ons with the, you know, the drill. So. Today, this is the look. Just want to show y'all my look um, because I have on lashes, my lashes. <laughs> and it's by me, Case Luxuries. This is the style Resting Lash Face. And this is available on my site. When you get the packet, it'll come inside of this bag with this wand brush. And it also, it also comes packaged <laughs> like this. Um, so yeah, if y'all are interested in some 100% mink lashes, hit me and my twin sister up at Cage Luxuries, cause we all about it. We all about it. <laughs> oh, and we're gonna be adding glosses. So, so let's get back to the video. You know what I'm saying? Let's go get back. Yeah. Yeah. First, we're going to be starting out with the drill heads and, you know, drilling our nail beds to get rid of any glossiness or any imperfections, such as, like, the nail polish you had on before. So, starting with my Kiss nail glue, I'll be putting it on my nail bed and, um, at the very tips, because I'm using tips, and applying the tips. And I also would like to mention that I got these tips offline, and it'll be all in the description box. And you see where I, I've spilled that glue. I didn't even know I spilled it, but yeah. Now I'm using my drill and I'm going to be drilling down my tips because I like to be a little bit even. But you know, it's my first time, so you know, we're just going with the flow. And I've been being to watching nail videos, so I kind of know a little bit. So now I'm clipping my nails and I'll be shaping them with my scissors so they can be stiletto nails. Money stickers I got from AliExpress. I'll be putting it on my thumb and like the other nails y'all see. And I'm gonna link where I got this from. And I'll also like to mention be careful when y'all open up this packet because I kind of ripped the top of mine. So yeah. So you're gonna need a glass cup. Make sure it's glass, not plastic, because we're working with I don't know what it's called, monomer, polymer, one of them. <laughs> because it'll melt, melt your cup and we're using that um, clear powder oh I'm moving too fast we're using the clear powder and I'm using one of my old makeup brushes don't touch me I'm getting my paper towel so you know you could you can dip and wipe but yeah this is the clear I'm using the clear acrylic powder and oh Keep in mind, I don't I have any primer at all, so what I did was look on Google over alternative, and I use acetone, that's why I put that in the camera frame. So this is my alternative, and it actually works.
With my index finger, I'll be using the pink acrylic powder. Also, we'll be linking that down below. Nearly everything I'm pretty much using is at from Aliexpress. So yeah, I put it on the tip of my nail for design purposes. <laughs> Now I'm going to be using a lighter pink for my middle finger. And like y'all see me, y'all see me applying that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get into it. see what I see it look awful but you know I'm new at this and so I'm gonna be using my neon acrylic powder for my match ring finger finger where I applied the lighter shade. I applied some neon on top and as well as the darker shaded pink on that middle finger. So after applying the acrylic very horribly, I'll be going in with my drill so we can even this out. And I'm starting off with the um, dark, like a buffier know what these hairs are called i'm not even gonna try it but this is the brown okay <laughs> so people have been wondering how i get my stiletto nails the shape it is use that that very the drill is your best friend right now use that still like the not the brown heads but the silver heads to like get that perfect shape you want okay The silver heads are perfect for also getting your cuticles and stuff, so make sure y'all get that too. Or like if you want your um, your acrylic to like look like it's your real cuticle shape or something like that, you know, use that. together we're shaping we're shaping and we're alternating between the silver one and the brown head all throughout you know of me you know shape my nails <laughs> Get that cuticle cold girl several times, many times. <laughs>
Now I'm going to be using some more of the money stickers. And I'd also, also like to mention that some of them I had placed on my nail without knowing that I wasn't in frame. So I do apologize. So I'm getting my <coughs> oh jeez. So I'm getting my iridescent nail polish, and I'm polishing my fingers. I think all of my fingers actually has this polish on them. Now I'm adding a piece on there. I don't know what it's called, but it'll be in the description box below. And I'll also be just pretty much decorating all of my nails right now. I have a gem on my marriage finger and my index finger. And I'm going to be taking those off, so I didn't show that on camera, but I'm going to be taking those off and the marriage finger, I'm going to replace it with the diamonds, I mean the jewels that y'all probably see in the frame, that right there in the black circular thing. I'm doing that and I'm putting some gold glitter on my index finger and again, I'm going to take off them diamonds. And for a top coat, if you're using what I'm using, I use the iridescent um, colors, I mean clear color, so yeah, no clear polish. So this is pretty much the finished look. Off camera, I actually cleaned around my cuticles. So yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Thank y'all for watching. I ask that you like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for the next video. Occur, occur.